Welcome, Nathan Edick here to break down this year's Final Four matchup between Kansas and Villanova. Kansas, the only remaining number one seed left in the tournament, versus the best basketball culture in the entire country in Villanova. Make sure you like this video, comment below with your predictions on who's gonna win, and make sure you subscribe to our channel for all things college basketball. Breaking down this matchup, it is all about style of play. Villanova must get this game to their tempo, their pace, they want long possessions, they're gonna use the shot clock, they're gonna force Kansas to guard for an extended period of time. On the flip side, Kansas, they're gonna wanna increase the number of possessions. They're looking to get early points in transition before Villanova can set up their half court defense. So style of play is a must for both Kansas and Villanova. Remy Martin has been an emergence for Kansas, the Midwest region most outstanding player. He is really quick, he's tough in transition, he has a really nice pull up, and he is going to keep coming at you every single possession. Ochai Abaji, we finally saw the regular season version of him in the second half against Miami with his ability to hit from the perimeter, He's an unbelievable athlete, ability to play above the rim. Obaji, All-American, one of the best scorers in all of the country. For Villanova, I really like Colin Gillespie in this matchup. Look for him to have a productive offensive night. Villanova's ability to attack David McCormick in ball screens is the key for Gillespie getting to his spots on the floor and having a productive night. Kansas is gonna have a tough decision to make. How are they willing to guard Gillespie's ball screens? Are they gonna have McCormick play in drop coverage and try to funnel him into mid-range pull-ups? Are they going to attempt to try to trap and make Gillespie give up the ball? I love Villanova. I love everything about their team. They are a coach's dream. They check every single box, defensively, offensively, from a culture standpoint. But the Justin Moore injury is devastating. It is too much to overcome. I look for Nova to hang around in this matchup, but I don't think they're gonna be able to overcome all the production that is lost with Justin Moore. It pains me to admit, but I'm taking Kansas in an absolute dogfight to beat Villanova. There is so much I love about Villanova. Number one in the country in free throw percentage. They make a lot of threes per game. Villanova does not hurt themselves. They don't have live ball turnovers. They don't take poor shots, but the offensive weapons of Kansas will be too much for Villanova to overcome. Remy Martin, Ochai Abaji, Christian Brown, Jalen Wilson, David McCormick. Kansas has weapons across the board that they can hurt you from an offensive standpoint. I feel so bad for Villanova, devastated with the Justin Moore injury for himself and their program. I just don't think they're gonna be able to overcome the production that he brings, the intangibles he brings on the court. Make sure you like this video, comment below with your predictions on Saturday night, and make sure you subscribe to our channel for future basketball content.